Hello everyone to the Dark Within. This is going to be a single video let's play because this is a rather short game. So, we begin with a big hole in our gut in a very, very, shall we say, dark place. And our whole goal is to, as you might well imagine, go get some medical attention. This is rather important when you have a big gaping hole in your abdomen or so I would imagine. Problem is, well, there's no one around. Everybody seems to be either dead, judging by the entrails hanging on the trees. There I go being all logical again, I guess, but... I guess when you have a big, you know, wound, you're not really thinking completely logically. You're just kind of hoping against all hope that someone's going to be there. Now, this game is actually really fun. I'm not a huge fan of platformers, but I love this game. Even as simple as it is. Because of, well, right there. That's another mechanic, and you're going to have to get used to using and abusing that mechanic to even get to the end of the game, because, well, there are obstacles, you'll see. As you can might probably imagine, if you don't try and use it, that's what happens. You kind of just jump into an abyss. It's that time, that time yeah, to neglect your... You can go back, betwe back between the land of the living and in this. So... What's happening? Ah, uh, well, I guess you could just imagine that maybe he's dead. Maybe he's just kind of like trying not to pass over to the other side. Maybe he is trying to pass over to the other side at this point. I mean, he's not dead. The big, you know, he's not exsanguinated quite yet. I'd imagine he would be soon. He's bleeding pretty good, it looks like there, but... It's the same music every time. I, I Before you ask, is it different music on the different radios? No, it's the same music every time. I like the music, personally. I'm, I'm assuming that's one of the creators singing there, but... Maybe not. I don't really know. Doesn't really matter, anyway. Now, this is another part of the puzzles. You might think, well, can't I just, like, use the thing that's made the bridge appear and do that? Yeah, you can. It's just... I don't know if you ever heard the theory of... Or if you ever watched Star Trek with, you know, with the transporter stuff. Just think of it like... Because... If you rematerialize inside of a solid object, you die in this game. Well, not really die. You don't really die in this game. You just have to restart from... A, the, I don't know what the, how to describe it. That, that jump is exceedingly difficult. Okay. <laughs> I'm not joking. That's, that, that jump is probably the hardest jump in this entire game right here. Well, not that one. <laughs> the one up there. Mainly just because you can't really see where your character is. But, uh, yeah. Just gotta get there eventually. Just gotta try and... Ah! Alright. <laughs> this might take a little while. I'm not really... Like I said, I'm not really good at platformers. So I'm sorry about that. But we'll get there eventually. Eventually. <laughs> oh, man. Now I can't even go up the freaking stairs. Ah! This is completely my fault, by the way. The, like, the first time I went through this, I got this first try. I don't know what's wrong with me right now. I guess it's because I'm on camera and I can't really concentrate as much as I normally was. Because I want to get a feel for the game, see what the game's like, and all that stuff. But the main draw of this is the story. So after you watch this Let's Play, you, uh, well, I would like for you to play the game, but I doubt you will. Uh, but, I mean, what you see is what you get here. It, I guess it's... Oh, crap. I was going to make a correlation to... It's not really similar to that game at all, what was I thinking? I was going to say Prince of Persia, but no. <laughs> anyway, this is where stuff starts getting freaky. Why are we flying? There's no logical sense. So either we're in an alternate dimension, which is looking exceedingly likely here, or we're already dead. Which I guess be could be construed as being in another dimension, to be fair. Oh, I didn't see that. <laughs> That's dirty. Okay, so can you see the solution here? Because I think I do. Also because I've, you know, played the game. That is it. That took me forever to find out. That took me probably about three or four minutes of solid just, what do? And I never really put it together until the end. Like I said, if you're watching this, you, I mean... Hopefully you don't mind the, the puzzles being spoiled. I mean, hell, you're watching a Let's Play. If you did, you probably wouldn't watch it in the first place. So, does anybody notice a correlation, like, as to what we're doing, as to where we're going? Does anyone even noticing what's going- well, that was pretty obvious right there. You, if you can't put it together now, I'm not gonna explain it to you. <laughs> a giant pill, hmm? 
I think we're going through a reference, not an, I was going to say an allegory of the human body, but I don't think allegory is the right word there. If we're going through like a... I don't know the proper English word for what the hell we're going through, but I, th I think we're going through something comparatively to a human stomach. Well, I have no idea where we were now. <laughs> the stomach was where the pill was, where are we now? Uh, I guess we're in our chest cavity. Or something that looks like a heart, and it's not going away. So that thing's there, in both dimensions. This should be fun. And... Now, I guess our goal is just to get rid of this and just try and throw something on top of it. Yeah, we're just gonna try and throw something on top of it. This should be fun. That was stupid of me. Just gotta jump, and jumping into it. There we go. Now if I just make these jumps, we'll be fine. <sighs> If I can just make those jumps, we will be fine. Unfortunately, that's a lot easier said than done. By the way, how much superhuman stamina does this man have? Like, if I had a big gaping hole in my abdomen, I don't think I'd be able to just jump around like this. I mean, crap dude would probably split your stitches even more doing this. If he even has stitches. Which he doesn't, which is why he needs them. And yes, this would be the twist. It was all in our heads. We were in surgery, or whatever it was, the whole time. But this was made in three days, I believe. This is a fun game for what it is. It's a fun platformer with a really somewhat disturbing plotline. Well, until the end. So, did I enjoy it? Yes, I quite enjoy this game. I played it through twice. That should say something. I don't usually play games that are this short through twice. Normally I play it once and we're done. This one I actually enjoyed enough to do it twice. But, uh, yeah, that is it. That's... No, seriously, that is the end of the story. There, there's nothing else. <laughs> After this, the, it just kind of sits there. But thank you guys very much for watching this one video let's play. Hopefully you enjoyed this in some fashion, shape, or form. And hopefully I shall see you next time. If you'd like to help support the channel and help it grow, you may wish to like or even subscribe. Farewell, everyone. Until next time.